वेलकम टू हेराल टीवी न्यूज बुलेटिन विद मी शालेन Citing Supreme Court's direction in 2020 directing issuance of fresh leases, Advocate General Devidas Pangam said that government is left with no choice but to go for fresh leases by the way of auction. He pointed to advance notices issued to leaseholders about expiry of their leases. The High Court of Bombay at Goa is hearing a petition by former mining leaseholders challenging taking over of their leases. The Goa government has told the High Court it has no choice but to go for fresh mining leases through auction. The Advocate General pointed out that the leases are appointed from 1961 and not from 1987. Renewal granted is not grant of fresh lease, AG Devidas Pangam told the High Court. The AG said Supreme Court directions are binding and the division bench of the High Court has accepted this. The state has to grant fresh leases and hence no relief may be granted to this petition, AG said. Advocate Norma Alvarez, advocate for Goa Foundation, said she finds herself on the same side as the AG. Not a single mining lease was in compliance with the law. They have no environment clearance, which was struck down by the Supreme Court, Advocate Alvarez stated. Viva Verma for Herald TV. Government has begun demarcation of land for the proposed IIT Goa project at Sange under police protection Friday. Sange MLA Subhash Valdesai has said that the project will not affect any fertile land. He said bogus farmers were trying to hinder the project. Farmers said they are not bogus. We own this land and we cultivate this land. Don't call us bogus. They shot back. Just stay you are bus lele log. They are meza kada kadun. Amcha lokanchir martha. My Karun Yatat Amcha Minshakalo, Marhan Data Amcha Mincha, Gari Galdat Amcha Mincha, and Mundat keep a project for the Kinesh Vash for the Sale Gunda Island Amka Male. Ashetarito Bebanao, Kai will tick pack shakta, permanently tick pack shakna. Shouta Kami Goyan with the Rai Tigurta, Fakta Munjak, Fido Konak, Kapang the Pashakta, Kurzadang the Pashakta, some poor Goyan the Pashakta, but maximum Fido war. Sangers that long. Dusre Sangta, Mother Swarta Sato, it cost Sangeche, Baledauce, Sangeche, Loka, Kruzgar, Mezzo, Sangamitur, Market Complex, Yoche, and Itaja Kadramitu is Kelasa. But a first tanga, and Chep Sangavel and Luke Tanga, we wrote Kurda, and it tanche settlement as a settlement with her good bird data. Munun, Lokani Vichar Kurzo, how it can Sangta, Izami Sakafode, Pike de Wacha, Charanakadin Garet, and Jagadini, Ami Pratana Kili. कि एखादे वे सुभाष फळदेसाई एक अयोग्य मार्गान होता लोकांचेर अन्याय अत्याचार करता जाले माका अद्दल गडे या सर्व समक्ष चित्रित केले असा आऊ देवाकडे मागता मजे मनाने एक मातोय मातोय एक शंकना किंवा स्वार्थ ना म्हणून आऊ सांगता कारण आम्ही देवाकडे वचून आऊ तसे देवाकडे वचून बी असे म्हणणं आपण प्रत्येक लोक येता माका श्राप घालता की पाईक देव तुका तीन दिसा भीतर दाखयतलो आठवड्या भीतर दाखयतलो एका कदाचित माका कितेय घडपाके शकता आपण मजो मिया असा माका कितेय घडले जाल्यावर बसून IIT project is not going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to do it. I am going to be able to Gaiti or Sandali, Ogla Gamcha Loka, two poison Octa or Rocata. Anike Kamso Daner, Dutor Astlo, Tachena Peregin Pereira. So at Sogla Dongrak Bon, Amka Octa Adun Ditalo, Anik Daita Dan Bore Datale. Anik House Noko Yet Dongo Doritor Gelo Daler, Tim Octa Coinsor and Kamioteli. Dusres Water Mutler Ami. IIT chair opposed nine. Hmm. Ya yeah, amche jaite zante lokanche sheta pidiar jateli. Zori tori IIT anga sor aili zaler. Aje na nanda ma pari. Okay. Ma jo IIT jibad viroj na. Hmm. Amche anga sheta sa ma jo go saata daawar sa astana anga sheta itale ma jo maow ata shemur war sa down melo. Majo go at a itli versa shatru italo hanga, ami te shatachi rami pot burta, majo go kam karina. Tena yaka amcha shatacher tene kidet viro yamcha shat amchela amkazai. 
तेजेर तेणे शेतर किदेंच हाँ हाड़े ना विरोधक तेने मुखार ये नहीं शेतर शत रो आता शेता क्या आ फ्त गोरवा ये आता ये सत आठ वर्षा शेत रोप मेलोना आई रात शेत रोन मजो घोव आव हंगा न्हिता शेत लिवले मुटगी रात सुधा मोहिनी फाला सतड़ीर घलतली रात गोरवा खाली जिमेलो हंगा प्रॉब्लम इश्यू हंगा प्रॉब्लम जो दंगर रोता शेत वोता शेत सकोर दंगर रोता शेत रोई हाथ आज पास रोई हाथ ना तो आयोजना फोट मारना फोट मारपा गरज नई आता दंगर गए उपरान कित शेत पुरवतले वो ना पुरवतले दंगर कसलो शेत पुरवतले कित को खुं रोई हाथली कित जी ये सारे दोंगर जल्म आये पासन ये देवान कि भाजी देवान किलो भाजी वो हाथी कोरपुले ना गोष्टी ना को पीए मुना ना कुडे मुना ना किल मुना ना तेरे मुना हा भूगान हान दीस का ये जमड़ी देवान कि हाथों गोरवा गिन वाली का हाथी तो उड़का शेता ये आता कसली जैसे बाबा कित्या जी योली एक लाकड़ा बड़ मेटली ना एक भाजपा मेटलो ना गोष्ट हाथी तो मार हाथी किरमुले हाथी सोलह जमड़ी फोड़न हाथी गोरवा गिन आसतना ये भाषे जी वाना गरीब पराशी कुआस पोस्ट को भूगी शेता आज बसन शेमा शे पाए माए पाए मेलो आज बसन ये शेत सामाणन दौला जीता है बाबा फोट मुठी संगना काल पर बसन पीक का एप्रिला महीन वायंगण पास गीम रोयता आती गोरु लगता है दुको लगता है आता मैं दोन हजार पास रोलो ना तू फोट मार जैसे कोई विचार शेत रोयता है क्या पड़ों हाँ आज बसन शेत पड़ों हाँ शेतोड़ो रोयता है सोली पड़ों ना खुशी शेतोड़े पास हिंगा ये जो नाका ना ये नाइट हमें शिकलो ना जालोली ना कसलो नड़ोली उपरान आम पास पुरवतली गांव पास उदो ये After the Zuari Bridge mishap another SUV fell into a creek off the Vasco Kortalem highway at 4 a.m. Friday. Four persons who were trapped in the vehicle were rescued by Vasco Fire Services crew and shifted to GMC by 108 ambulance in a critical condition. The accident occurred near Rima Ba Chikali. Locals stated that this is an accident prone zone. After the Zuari Bridge mishap another SUV fell into a creek off the Vasco Kortalem highway at around 4 a.m. on Friday. Four persons were trapped in the vehicle. They were shifted to GMC by 108 ambulance in a critical condition. This is a very strange accident. We are going to see the street lights. We are going to see the streetlights. We are going to see the streetlights. So, we are going to see the road on the side of the road. We are going to see the road on the side of the road. So, we are going to see the road on the side. जाऊंग प्रोविजन कर आमी आम कहीं पा कारण एक चल गाड़ी चलो लगली क्या फोन आसता ना उलता फास्ट चलता गाड़ी आनी वो एक्सिडेंट जो चल देव कृपे तंका कहीं जाऊना वोली देव आर्गा ये आनी दुसरी एक गोष्ट थे कि कलेक्टर एक लेटर के गवर्मेंट प्राइमरी स्कूल आसा थे रंबलर घपा खूब आवश्यकता भाषे ये सैड सत्त कपेल आस पे ते मे फुढ़े थे रंबलर घपा खूब जरूरत आ कारण थे गे पांच स वर्षा मैं दिता चार तरी एक्सिडेंट जैसे एक्सिडेंट जो तो मनीस थे मेले आसा सो अभी नहीं मुन रमलर घपा जरूरत खूब आसा हमें लेटर कलेक्टर के साढ़े चार हाँ वो पणजे पास गाड़ी आई जैसे कंट्रोल जाऊँ ना गाड़ी सकल पड़ी ढग नवा जो लाइन तीन पैले थे थोड़ा चौक जाना आशिने गाड़ियन 
आनी हंगा म्हटल्यार एक तर फायर विकेट आनी एम्बुलन्सान तांकां बरें हेल्प केले दुसरें म्हटल्यार हंगा डिवायडर बीन अशें कांय ना डायरेक्ट गाडी तूं फास्ट भितर पडली हांवें फोन पयले आनी मागीर गेलो किरण बोरकर फॉर टी व्ही Goa Excise Commissioner Narayan M Gard started hearing the complaint filed by advocate Iris Rodriguez over the illegally obtained liquor license by an upmarket Silly Souls Cafe and Bar allegedly being run by Union Minister for Women and Child Development Smriti Rani's family at Botawado Asagao. The excise department has issued a notice to the cafe owners to file their written reply. The next hearing is scheduled for 22nd August 2022. Excise Commissioner has uh, yesterday started hearing this matter on the complaint filed by me against the illegal Silly Souls Bar and Restaurant at Asagao, which is being uh, run by the family of Union Minister for Child and uh, Women Development, Smriti Irani. The Excise Commissioner has uh, heard us on the matter. The Excise Commissioner has uh, framed two issues. Uh, to be decided by the uh, excise commissioner and he has uh, directed the uh, owners of the restaurant to file their written submissions on and and has kept the matter for for the next hearing on uh, uh, 22nd of august as the excise department is now busy with the panchayat election there was no restaurant when the license was given so i pointed out all this and and the fraudulent way in which the license has been uh, renewed in the name of a dead person so all the documents on record speak for itself and i'm sure the excise commissioner will will decide uh, accordingly meanwhile the other departments are also seized of the matter the director of panchayats is uh, also seized of the matter because the panchayat has now informed me that uh, no no permission was given for the construction of this restaurant rani che i have never said that the restaurant is in her name i have said and i maintain what i say the restaurant is being run by the family of smriti irani the whole world knows this and that is a fact so i have nowhere said that the license is in her name the license is was in the name of mr anthony gama who has passed away now one of the son has come today the other son because i have also pointed out we need to know where the other son is although we know where he is they have to come out with the truth and say where he is now since the construction itself is illegal and that is what the uh, panchayat has uh, admitted publicly okay by giving me information on the rti that they have not given any licenses whatsoever but more importantly the town and country planning department because of this land filling that is a very serious issue i have also pointed out to the town and country planning minister mr vishwajit rane i have drawn his attention i filed a written complaint with the chief town planner yesterday and i'm sure they will act written submissions were made to the commissioner there are several statements made in the in the in the, in the complaint the authority has to narrow down that to certain specific issues and once you narrow down that certain issues will become easy for determination as to who has to prove what and what are the issues that have to be decided so that's what it is kept for on the 22nd and so what remains the status of the license the new excise license has been issued license continues Once the fees are paid, license always continues. But the purchase, you must understand one thing: that here we are governed under the Portuguese civil code. Once we are governed under the Portuguese civil code, the ownership of the property is jointly in the name of the husband and wife. The Marga Municipal Council launches an anti-encroachment drive at various footpaths across the town. The drives were launched opposite the Marga railway station at Borda and at Powerhouse Circle. Kiosk owners opposite the Marga railway station resisted the dismantling of their kiosk since they argued that they were there for many years. MMC authorities said they were blocking the footpaths. Marga Municipal Council has launched an anti-encroachment drive on Thursday. Kiosk and structures opposite the Marga railway station at Borda and Powerhouse Circle were removed. आम्ही तिंगा आशिले पहिली आमका भीतर आमका शिफ्टिंग केले आमका अंगा शिफ्ट करताना आमका कोण घरा मिरा कोण गेले आपण त्यांना जागो दिलो त्यांना तेडा मार 
आदित्य बिद्रे फॉर हेरल टीवी St. Anthony Manasioli defeated Alle Youth Association 2-0 and moved into the quarter-final of the 23rd All Goa Our Lady of Maces 8 aside Inter Village Tournament 2022 played at Our Lady of Hope Church Ground Chishini. Mayuresh Naik missed a sitter in the 5th minute. In the 10th minute, Mayuresh put his team Sioli Marna in the lead. Dalish Pednekar of Sioli Marna made it 2-0 in the 19th minute. Arle Youth Sweden Barbosa shot was brilliantly saved by Sioli keeper Vipul Pednekar. At half time, the score was 2 0 in favour of Sioli Manna. Preston Rego's clearance was misjudged by Sioli's Vipul, thus making the score 2 1. Inacio Narona for Herald TV. Four occupants of an SUV, the lady driver and three others died after their vehicle rammed into the railings of the Zuari Bridge and then plunged into the river. The bodies were recovered after a four-hour rescue operation on Thursday by 1.30 p.m. The Indian Coast Guard, Navy, Fire and Emergency Services and Goa Police personnel had launched a massive search operation. The bodies have been identified by relatives and brought to Goa Medical College for post-mortem. The names of the deceased were given as Priscilla Tavares Cruz, Henry Arauj, Alvin Arauj and Austin Fernandez. The accident occurred around 12.45 am on Thursday morning. The vehicle coming from Margao side swerved to the right side of the road and hit the bridge railings. The vehicle was reportedly being driven at a high speed. The SCVU could not be traced at night. Nuve MLA Aleso Sequeira said the vehicle belongs to Priscilla Tavares Cruz of Lothari. The vehicle was located around 1 p.m. on Thursday and was salvaged by a crane and put onto a ferry boat. The bodies were then removed from the car and sent for post-mortem to GMC. Now in a major tragedy, bodies of four persons, that means three men and one woman, were found in a car involved in the tragedy that took place at Zuari Bridge that shocked the entire state and the country this early morning. 
The overspeeding vehicle was reportedly hit by the side railings of the Juari Bridge and plunged into the river. The car number is GA08K8334 that plunged into the water from the Juari Bridge late night at around 1 in the morning. Team Herald visited the spot at that moment and took uh, this as their breaking news and broke this news which created sensation and lots of people gathered next morning to witness what was actually happened. Now according to the information available, the fire service officials, the names of the deceased persons are Presley De Cruz, Henry Araujo, Olvin Araujo and Austin Fernandez. The dead bodies have been shifted to GMC for post mortem. Several leaders as well as from the political side as well as other leaders came to the site including some locals and visitors. The car belongs to Priscilla Cruz. The car is not the residence of the family and the members are not traceable. However, by evening, the car was fished out by nearly 3 to 4 in the afternoon. In this operation, not only the Navy was involved, but also the Coast Guard, the Indian Coast Guard, the Indian Navy, fire officials, police and several others. The operation was almost, almost solved within about 16 to 14 hours. But it took almost 12 hours, nearly 10 hours to identify the spot, exact location of where the car was. But by evening, everything was solved. The car was fished out and the bodies were still inside the car. With the help of the crane, the car was fished out and then once the car was landed on the crane boat, the bodies were taken out. The bodies that were in front were removed first, while the other two were taken later. This incident shocked the entire state. The Goa police, along with Coast Guard, Barges, Fire Emergency, Indian uh, Navy, Indian Coast Guard Service personnel launched an operation to locate the waker. But this couldn't happen last night. That's why it happened in the morning, because of the darkness. Herald TV visited the spot once again. Here are the visuals that you can see the entire scene of what is happening. With Clinton D'Souza, Shagun Gaude, Kiran Borkar, Prasad Poji for Herald TV. Nerol villages blocked the road and demanded the immediate dismantling of the mobile network tower which was erected overnight at Nerol Market Bardes. Villagers threatened to continue to keep the road blocked until authorities order the immediate dismantling of the tower. Locals from Nerul gathered at the location on Thursday morning and demanded immediate dismantling of the tower, claiming that they don't want it in the residential or market area. The villagers blocked the road. The villagers also threatened to continue and keep the road blocked until any authority orders immediate action on the tower and the mobile company. They further threatened to protest if the tower was not immediately taken off. Villagers argued with the telecom company officials stating that they were misled by saying that the work was for Bowell was going on and by when the reality was for installation of a mobile tower. Since the tower is installed near a school, it was and it will have adverse effect on the health of the children here, the villagers said. Watch.
जेना गावा गावानी टावर घता टावर घाचा पैली लोकल जी बॉडी आसता तंका कॉन्फिडन्सान घोपे आसता थे लोकल लोक आसा तंका कॉन्फिडन्सान घोपे खे टावर बनता ये इम्पॉर्टंट तंका दाखोप जाए जेना हंगा एक्सप्लोरेशन वर्क चालू के पैली लोक संगले हिंसानी कि हंगा बोरवेल मारता मूँ मगर जो जो तो फोटो वाड़ गो तक संगले कि सैप्टीक टैंक मारता मूँ आता फाइनली तुम पैला तो कॉन्क्रीट बेस तैयार कर रातिया राती रातीी अड़ेजन तंजानी काम चालू के टावर आता हेद उड़ला घाला अजू जो संगता कि टावर ऑपरेशनल करा ना मूँ जो ऑपरेशनल करा ना जो हाँ आता के हाथों डिसमेंटल कर गरज आता दिस अश्मिता पोलजी फॉर हेराल टीवी Penne police conducted a flag march in Penne in view of the upcoming Goa Panchayat elections. Police said no illegal acts will be tolerated since the model code of conduct is in force. They also cautioned liquor sellers not to sell liquor to those who will misuse it for election purposes. Police told bar owners that bars should be closed by 10 p.m. DSP Siddhant Shirkar, Penne Police Inspector Dattaram Raut, Mopa Police Inspector Mahesh Kerkar and others were part of the squad. Police said they will not allow any untoward incident during elections. Today, uh, we have conducted a, some kind of a called as a flag march to impress upon the people that we will not tolerate any uh, illegal acts. Model code of conduct is in force. We have also briefed the bar owners and the wholesalers not to get involved in selling alcohol to people who will use it. For election purposes, and also not to violate the timings given by the respective district magistrate. Uh, sir, timing is there, sir? The notification is issued, and we have explained the notification to them. Also, we have uh, gone and uh, briefed the, some shop owners. We have checked scrap yards. We have gone and visited certain restaurants, and we have visited certain uh, persons who are likely to create. law and order issues during the election and they have been warned and explain the repercussions so in pernem and mandre we have panchayat elections in 10 panchayats and we are not going to allow any untoward incident to happen in our area whoever and whatsoever makbul for herald tv A Jersey cow was found lying in the water channel in Kasarwane in the middle of the night. The fire brigade was informed about this at midnight. The fire services rushed to the spot without wasting time. After a lot of struggle, the cow was finally rescued by the fire brigade. A Jersey cow was rescued in Kasarwane Perne. The cow was trapped in a pit at around midnight. The fire services rushed to the spot and rescued the cow. So, ashe dare ki तुम्हें ती गाय जी आसा पे ती समा ते सामून आर ती मरू शकता आल सो पुण मजा ड्यूटी क्रू आसा पे तंजे तक उदक प्रोवाइड के थोड़े कि खापा थी ग्रास आसा पे मैं कट कर ड्यूटी क्रू सका साढ़े चार थन पांच स्टेशन पाले पर साढ़े सर ती जे सी बी आई पर ड्यूटी क्रू थे गए वीथ द हेल्प ऑफ जे सी बी रोप जे आसा डिफरंट रोप्स आसा पेड़ फायर स्टेशन बरबर जो स्टाफ आसा सुनील देसाई आसो विठल पर राजन राजेश पर विकास चौहान आनसिपाली जो लेबर दिला जे डिजास्टर मैनेजमेंट जे दिता वर्सा तो लेबर आसो इतने जे लेबर आजे स्टाफ जो आता तेज एफर्टान जी गाय जी आती ती सेफली रेस्क्यू के मकबूल फॉर हेरल टीवी That's all we have in today's news bulletin. Thanks for watching Herald TV News. For more news alerts, please follow us on Oheraldo on Facebook and Twitter. Take care and goodbye.